Welcome back, everybody. I'm Trollman98. Thanks for joining all you wonderful people. Look at this goose art. It's pretty neat. That's pretty cool, too. This video is absolutely incredible. Digital Tron. Ooh, Taskmasters. This is a pretty good card. Unreal set this card's power equal to the power of the last card you played. Really good. Ooh, I can upgrade Cloak. Thank you. Yeah. Shiny logo. Mutants always get upgraded. Oh my gosh, I gave Mystique Shard. Check you out. She's totally getting upgraded. Those are gladly welcome. Folks, mother. And Rogue's father, I'm pretty sure he's going to be now. Yog hurt, son. Dude, what does that even mean? If you know, please leave in the comment section down below. I'm looking it up. How's that a Marvel quote? Yog hurt. This is not like, I do not recall this. It shows yogurt? What is this title I just got? I wonder. I apparently you get avatars from that. I've used to get avatar. What the heck? Wait, where did it even go? Oh yeah, I don't remember. Click your own avatar, and then you can change your titles. I always have an always snap that I got from a crate, but it's not the snap event anymore. Yog hurt son. Is this just a meme? Marvel. Yeah, Marvel snap. What the hell is this? This is somebody's first one, like, everything can explain it? No, they don't even know! It's... This Reddit post doesn't even know what that means. Uh... Is it really just a yogurt... reference? Dude, I don't want to put it up as freaking offensive. I don't even know what that means. Uh, I guess we'll keep all these snaps? What in the world? Anyway, moving on from- <laughs> Moving on from whatever the heck that means would be greatly appreciated if you do know what that means, but a quick little Google search. I don't know what that means, we're not going to derail the whole video. Just figure that out. Oh, play ongoing cards! Oh shoot! Play ongoing cards. Does Rogue count? Now, I know Professor X is an ongoing card, so I could probably just get it done by playing him. Um, but I could put in some other ongoing mutants if we really want to get this done. Let's just open the mutant deck. Ongoing. Does Rogue, Rogue Steel's ongoing? Yeah, she's on reveal, technically. Did I, wait, the question is, did I get my on reveals done? I have not gotten unrevealed stun yet. Okay, so so we'll I can worry about that after. But I may want to make a new deck here with ongoing. Wait, how much time is left? The event. Oh, there's still a whole week. I might just get that just with Xavier though. But I believe Colossus is ongoing. He's a great way to get it. Um. But yeah, I believe all of my other cards are either none or on reveal. Xavier is the only ongoing. 100 power, win with the snap. Oh, I'm supposed to win with the snap anyway. Yeah, the whole snap is fine. Uh, play cards, play five cards. Play three cards, cards. Win a location with only one card. Now, I want to gambit avatar with a quote. would be insanely cool. I'm not spending 20 to 30 dollars for it like that other deal was up here. But that's cool, because like when you break a thousand, you have a chance to get titles and avatar pictures for free. That's insanely cool. But yeah, I was watching other streamers that actually were like around my level. So sorry I figured that out, because one of them actually got an avatar from that. I was like, whoa. Window Clash only one card now. Xavier can probably get that done. And of course... Oh no, actually it does not have a power limit. I don't even have to use Xavier. Anyway, let's go on. Played that enough, not knowing what the freaking yogurt sun means. Also, like, just the sun title in general seems insulted. Like, for one, they may not even be male. 
Oh my goodness, the, the Karma Jar. Oh my goodness, double ice spin off the start. This is absolutely brutal. Although then my double me was something too. Perfect for my unrevealed deck. Absolutely perfect. Dude, Jubilee's gonna double Jubilee. Oh my goodness. She's gonna double Jubilee. Oh, but they have, when you play a card, you add a copy to another location that's even better than freaking Jubilee's one. Oh, how interesting. Oh my goodness, that didn't play it in my favor. A double Gambit? Dang, dude. Ah! Oh, that was a great play of that. Oh, it's gonna double buff the deck. Oh, that's brutal. So now I'm instantly losing this side. That sucks. Oh, it's double Jubilee. Let's go. The Giganto on the left. Perfect. Oh my goodness. Perfect. Praise God. So now I got Emma, my third strongest. Oh, this is very good. Oh, he hit me with the minus eight, though. That was brutal. Double minus eight, or that was really brutal. Oh, that blocked me from playing Hulk in the center, too, but... I just gotta hope Hulk on the side. Yeah, I can't blame him for snapping that one. Snap, I'm not snapping. Dude, the double green goblin, that was absolutely atrociously brutal. So lucky he didn't randomly go to the left. Yeah, he got me because of that. Well played. Well, he got lucky. His frickin' apocalypse went to all the zones he needed. What an epic showdown. Thumbs up that one. That could've gone either frickin' way. What an awesome game. Yeah, he knows it too. He knows that was a great match. Yeah, he got lucky, dude. If, if his frickin' hobgoblin goes anywhere else or that apocalypse, he loses. Wow. That was just an awesome showdown. Almost done with the unrevealed. I may want to actually change my deck here and just use these other mutants. Because that might be the only way to get that ongoing one done in time. Because I do not always play Professor X. Oh, I didn't see what today's special event was. I don't know if there is one. Special zone, I should say. Move one lucky. location to the right, that's terrible. I gotta play over here then. I want my right zone to fill up. Let's see here. Yeah. No, I got tons of good cards. I don't think I can gambit at all. Fudge. Oh, well, he skipped his first two turns. That's not getting along. My goodness, he's got Infinite. Well, I have Infinite now. I may want to use that Infinite. Oh, he's truly running Odin. Wait, why the hell did Jubilee just work twice? Oh, because Odin came down and re-triggered her. That botched its right side, though. Dang, he can just infinite win now, I think. And there's nothing I can do about it.
Thing, I actually didn't have enough going over because I forgot Caitlyn was right here. Dude, that is brutal. Dude, Jubilee ain't gonna do much. Dude, I think I got a Gambit, actually. Hope Gambit kills a mofo. Yeah, I need Gambit to kill someone on the far right so I win that zone. Go Gambit. He sees Gambit. He moved Vision. Kill someone on the far right, Gambit. Use magic. Yes! That tied that zone. Opponent snapped. Now, he snapped because he's going to summon down now Infinite. But I can beat Infinite if I put a card where Infinite won't be. Where will he put Infinite? I'm already minning, winning the middle. No, surely he'll put Infinite on the left. That's forced play. Yeah, he just got me, I think. That's a forced play to put Infinite on the left. There's nothing I can do about that to beat that to win. I have to put Giganto to make his lead lessen, but that's still probably going to be enough to win. Yeah, I'm not snapping. He could still misplay it and put it in the middle. I really doubt he'd be that dumb, though. Oh, he just moved! Oh, I forgot Vision could move multiple times! Wait! He just lost the match for not playing Infinite! Victory. What? Did he summon turn 5? Oh, I guess he summoned Vision turn 5! Well, he could, uh, yeah, I got him. Sweet. He tried to get cheeky by moving Vision. Thank god I didn't play the middle. Now, I didn't play the middle because I was already winning there. I betted that he was going to botch that zone, which he did. That was complete random. Completely random. I know I'm supposed to win a snap match, but that was too random to actually. Oh no, I already did win a snap match. Oh, was that me that snapped it? It might have been. Maybe that was a match match before. I don't even recall, dude. Now I need ongoing cards. Do I change the deck? It's the question. We don't get only one card, so that could just happen. Could I cop? Wait, wait. Something happened. In the season pass. That's freaking freaking old. Beautiful. Beautiful. Uh, let's see here. Ongoing meeting deck. Let's name it. Ongoing strong. Snap back is this. And then I filter. I'm going. How many mutants are there? Wait, this is saying. Rogue isn't ongoing. She steals. Obviously, Professor X. Onslaught. Yeah, I can't make a deck like that. And be mute. Whoa, poor path. Oh, and no more. Wait, strong art? Is also ongoing? But he's not gonna fix, I can't ditch my cards. <laughs> oh, sorry about that. I think my cough drops run out. Still trooping through. Yeah, I can't really make a deck like that. I'll probably put off just modifying my other deck. But I could add the classics back in here. Because none of these other cards are mutants. It's strong guy is, but... Like, strong guy's not going to be that helps by it, though. I feel like it's just going to tank my elo doing this. My very hard-earned elo. Of 
question is if Rogue counts or not. This shows her as an ongoing card. She may count. But it may only be when she actually steals the ability. Well, I'm gonna worry about that. I'm gonna maybe make that off screen. Don't worry about that later. Like if, I, if it actually comes near the, to the end of the event. Because I could just add Colossus in here and he could probably help get it himself. Or, or armor. No, armor's not great because armor will protect against Gambit. Yeah, it'd be Colossus adding back. I think that's a better reasonable thing to do, to just slowly build it up with Colossus and Xavier. I sadly don't have enough mutants to build a different deck, although I could just have it slightly... Uh... You know what? Maybe it only needs to be a half ongoing deck. I only need 30. Wait, where'd Wolverine go? Oh, because that's not the ongoing filter. What's that? Where's Wolverine? Isn't he a 3 2? No, he's a 2 3. There he is. That's the right one, right? Yeah, I'm on that one. Can I not filter by, like, species? No. You cannot filter by species. This could be his F. I mean, obviously, I still play Quicksilver. So yeah, it has, like, no one cost, doesn't it? Yeah, it has no one cost at all. So, Quicksilver. Oh, no, I can put Angel in. Angel, if somebody's killed, that's more unique. Although Quicksilver is better than Angel. Should I put it? No, I'll just put Angel in. Screw it. Use the other mutants. Um. Dude, Onslaught powering up Warpath is gonna be bonkers. Wait, Skiller Witch is a mutant, but... Oh, I do technically need one more. To cast. I need another five cost? Oh no, it's my... No, I have two four cost. I have... Oh, oh wait, Skiller Witch is a two cost. I need another three cost. I just put Gamut or Rogan? I should put Rogan just in case she counts. Although this card has superfluous cards, I could maybe use Gambit. Oh, you know what? We could throw Wolfsbane in there. Dude, Wolfsbane is crazy good. Give us some more power. Wolfsbane. Ooh, we could go for Storm, too! I think we need the power of Wolfsbane, honestly, for the deck. This is kind of like a... It's so hard to use Warpath and more though. But I think Wolfsbane's better for them. Is there... Oh, Leech! There's another 5 cost mutant. Throw Leech in there. Or Matt. Wait, I could use Magic too. Magic, I don't think, fits the theme of the deck though. So Leech, though. I was using Magic before. And of course, Shiganto. Although, there is Apocalypse? But Shiganto is an actual mutant. But I'm still missing a cost here. Oh, it's because I only have one, one cost in there.
I could throw in Quicksilver. The question is, do I want a different? Oh, Sunspot, of course. Yeah, so he's the other mutant one cost I hardly ever use. Oh my goodness, I did. I made a mutant deck with ongoing. It's not fully ongoing, but I made another mutant deck. Heck yeah. Wait, let's name it ongoing X strong, because they all have the X gene. There we go. This I don't think is the greatest deck, but we'll see. Less card of an ongoing ability. I'm not sure Mystique. Wait, I don't know if Mystique is a wait. I could instead of Wolfsbane use Morph that I've like never used. Where's Morph? Because maybe Morph will steal some good ability here. Where's Morph? There he is. Uh, yeah, I don't think I've really ever used Morph. Here we go, let's go. Not, not like to take a second, but like I almost never do deck theory or building. Now this one seems like a very meh tier deck, but it might be better than my other one. I highly doubt it though. Dude, it's so hard to get up to this rank though, and I'm bringing a different deck. Yikes. It really doesn't matter though, it's so arbitrary. Oh, whoops, I didn't select the other deck. I still have the other deck in. Dang it, I forgot how it worked. Ongoing effects are disabled here. Well, it was a good thing I didn't bring that deck. Is that the theme for today? I need a look. I would completely screw this, that deck. Oh, maybe I do need to bring Storm or Magic to remove that zone. Or Scarlet Witch. Yeah, oh, Mantis is gonna need it. Right on time. I like Mantis, she's a great card. <laughs> Look at that, so dynamic of a shot. Incredible. Played No Turn 2, interesting. It's fully a fully discard deck. Oh, first to fill. Wait. This is perfect for here. Oh, he actually didn't play it. Sneaky. I could probably just bring Colossus in and get this daily done, but. Dude, I got a free Giganto. That's insanely good. He's gonna... he stare snaps me. Dang, I can't use Xavier. But this is why I'm gonna make that ongoing deck. Dude, I can play Hellcat last turn if I don't get a Hulk here. Let's see what Jubilee can accomplish. Well, some turns now, so that happens. Don't know if that actually plays in my favor. So I really do not have great stuff for this turn at all. Like, that's pretty terrible play. Oh, that just makes me lose. Dang, dude, that's a terrible play. That's the best play I got, though. Odin. That's weird. That doesn't fit the theme of this deck. Yes, I got Hulk. That's what I needed. Giganto Hulk snap. snap. That's why you win the raft. 
Very nice. Double sixes for turn seven. That's why I always win the raft, bud. Dude, that was great. The White Queen made him not even try to go after the raft. Dude, that was a good deck. Dude, look at this guy's Magneto. That's crazy cool. That's actually what I want, so I don't have to use Hulk anymore. I want Magneto. I make it full X gene. But right now it's just a mutant deck. Which Hulk is a human mutate. Like, the opponents are so strong, I'm so screwed if I use that other deck, though, dude. This one sucks, just to get the stupid things done. What if it's only one card? I mean, I might be able to win that with the more or something. But that winning location with only one card is so difficult. Would that deck do it better? Would it win one location with one card? No, oh, it's got less total power. Although Namor is a beast. I just think it has less of a chance in this current deck to win it. But I feel like I made this deck, so I should maybe just try it out once. Let's just end off the video doing it once. Versus Ed here. I will be shocked if I win with this deck, but you never know. Mark could just turn into something insanely strong. Wow, and I have no one cost play now because of that. That was brutal. Players can only play one card a turn. That was a brutal use of sand, man. When you play a card, you fold this with copies of it. Oh, uh, Warpath might be able to pull that off? Dang, though, it wasn't Giganto. That's, I'm, that's not great. Do have Professor X that zone? Oh, you just killed my Professor X. That was brutal. Yeah, he's just gonna kill tons of my cars. Interesting, that's the strategy. Well, he free yielded that zone, I'll take that. I Man, if I had Wolverine, then that would have summoned my. Okay. I still have two cards left, that's funny. Dang, he got his sunspot, that's brutal. Well, now I'm gonna use sunspot here. Electra kills Angel, and- HA <laughs> HA! He forgot armor was preventing Electra from killing stuff! Take that, you jerk! Oh dang, dude. Oh my gosh, how did Warpath get increased even more? That screwed me! Oh, how did Warpath get increased its cost even more? What the hell? I could just leech the utter crap out of him. I think I have to leech the utter crap out of him. Get leeched, bud. Oh my gosh, that's huge misplay by him. I've won. Unless he can move these guys out of the way. Dude, I can't believe he double increased the cost of Warpath somehow. I don't even know how that happened. Peak plus Icebox. Oh my goodness, that's how. Wait, Chikandos actually weaker because he got debuffed. He's really snapping back. He thinks I can't win the zone. Is this a bot? Oh, that's what's happening. Wait, no, that's only one card. Oh, good for you, bud. Meet the barb onslaught. 
Nice, I won with his deck! This jank is hell deck is he hella misplayed! With Yondu! Doesn't matter how much power you have on the right, I don't need that zone to win, and he way under peaked the peak here. And then he forgot this electric could not kill because armor's here. So to ongoing deck. And someone gotta send Nap Victory of 8. I got insanely lucky with, the, with that stuff. I did not get the one card victory. I don't think the deck can do it. Um, I, I need to go back to the other deck probably. But how many did that get? That only got two ongoing cards. I go. Dang. Anyway, I can worry about that later. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you like what you saw. Please hit the like button, subscribe, hit that notification bell if you like to see more content like this. And as always, make your tail eternally. Be retold. Later.